Hi guys, Sport Tutor here and my name is Anil Deshpande. Welcome to the next edition of Building Location Aware Android Apps. So far what we have seen in this series is we are getting the device location and then we are displaying the location on the Google Maps. And to display the location on the Google Maps we have used things like support map fragment and map view. The next obvious choice would be to display the address based on the device location. Well getting the address based on the device location is called as reverse geocoding. To do that the precondition is you need to know the device location which we already have done and we already know how to do it. So next discussion that we are going to have is how to get the address and display it on the device. Well to do this we use a API called as geocoder. This geocoder API has a method called as get from location. As you would expect it basically takes three arguments latitude longitude and max results we will discuss about max results a bit later but latitude and longitude are pretty obvious you can fetch it from the location that we would have got from the earlier step now what does this max results mean well this particular method get from location returns a list of addresses so max results basically tells how many results you want in the response one two three so whatever the number that you put here the return would be the least with that many addresses so how do we go about using this particular api well, you have an activity and in the activity you get a location. After you get the location, you cannot get the address in the activity itself because it may take more time. So the ideal situation is this task should be moved to either a thread or a async task. But in the demo that I will be showing you, I would not be using even either a thread or a async task. I would use a intent service. So what will happen is from the activity, whatever the location that we have got, we will send that location to the intent service and the intent service will actually do the get from location and it will fetch the address and it will return the address back to the activity which I will display. As you can see a lot of communication is happening between activity and intent service. Well to do that we will be using result receiver which is of parcelable type. So there are quite a number of things that you should know before you even attempt to implement what I am going to show you. For example you should know how to work with the intent service, how to work with the parcelable how to communicate between activity and an intent service. You should have a concept of bound services. If you are new to this, you may struggle at understanding what I am doing. I will keep it as simple as possible. But if you are new to this, I suggest that you go through some of these tutorials on Code Tutor and then come back here. So I will just give you a glimpse of what the demo would actually look like. So here is the application. You can see that it is showing me the location. I have slightly modified the existing application that we had implemented in previous videos. Now it has get address button at the top. And now what I will do is I will click on get address and you can see that it is showing me some text. Well, this is what we will be implementing in the next video. So stay tuned for the next video. That brings us to the end of this particular video. Don't forget to like, comment, share the video and subscribe to the channel. Take care. Bye.